Hello everyone, it's Melody Snowflake. It's been an extremely long time since I posted on this channel, and that's because I was taking a really big hiatus, even from my main YouTube channel at some points, due to how busy 2022 has been. But the new year has started, so happy new year. And ironically, I am here to review a pretty old toy that was released all the way back in 2007, so 16 years ago now. This is a My Little Pony G3 Lily Lightly, and she lights up when you press this little button, which I'm going to show you in a little bit. So let's do a quick little review of the figure, and I'll show you how she works. So I got Lily off eBay, as she's actually my favorite My Little Pony G3 character. And as you can see, she is very different from your typical G3 or really just any pony figurine. She has actual eyelashes over here that can actually be felt. That's a really, really close close-up. Um, and her mane is a lot longer than a regular pony. There is also a dress that you might have noticed she's wearing, and it's not actually removable, even though it looks like you can take it off her. Her horn is basically the same as any other, but overall this pony is taller than a regular 3 inch. I would say she's at least 4 inches, but I can't really be sure. Lily must have come with some other accessories as well, but since I bought this off of eBay from a secondhand seller, it didn't come with anything but the figure. So now that we've done a quick little run through on what the figure looks like, let's show you how it works. So it's made of this plastic, I don't really know where the batteries go, if there are even batteries at all. And it's definitely a lot more, it feels more like a toy than a collectible. Um, you can move her head, but no other part of her is posable. You can't move her legs or anything like that. And you can't actually see her tail very well because it's concealed underneath the dress. But it's, it's definitely there. So this is how Lily works. There is a button on her tummy, and if you press it, her horn is supposed to light up a nice blue color. The only problem with that is, well, it is a pretty old toy, so it doesn't always work. So, let's just give it a quick try. Oh yeah, her eyes also blink. So you press this button, and she's supposed to light up. Let's move the camera to a slightly more shadowy part of the room that I'm currently in so we can actually see the light when it actually happens more clearly. There we go. So as you can see, her horn is lighting up and she also blinks when you press the button. Her mane is also super long and brushable. It actually came in pretty like amazing condition for its age. Though while trying to untangle a few knots, I did accidentally make the base a little frizzy. But it's still more or less in perfect condition, despite how old it must be. And yeah, I just really want to thank the seller for taking such good care of it. This is my first G3 pony, and I might collect more, but for now, this is all we have to see. You also might have noticed that I'm in a completely different room than I was in any of my previous videos. There are some posters here on a closet door, and there are some posters on that wall over there, and there are some plushies that I'm going to review in later videos from Danganronpa. But for now, Thank you so much for coming to my review of this G3 Light Up Lily Lightly. It's really cool to be able to collect a pony toy from a completely different era, from back when I wasn't even into pony, and I hope to show you guys more cool stuff in the future. 
So thank you so much for coming, and I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye, and Happy New Year.